hello, hello. <laughs> Did we you are miss us? back. <laughs> Who's excited to see us tonight? Because we're happy to be with all of you. How's everyone doing? Invite some friends, Matt says. That's right. Inve invite everyone you know. Tonight's going to be Sounds good. A That's right. One. We got lots of surprises. Something's over there that we're giving away tonight. Uh, I got so it right here. That's you. right. First one's uh, we're about 15 minutes away from the first set of 24 color markers here on the evening. You see it right there, Hello, right here at Color Betty. Central. Let's say hi to Amy watching from her bed. Oh, she has a stomach virus. I'm so sorry to hear that. Oh, that stinks. Hello, Annette. Thank you. We're happy to be back. Charlene, who's excited? Pants clapping away. Yes, everyone is so happy tonight. We're back. Wow, we have a new viewer. So Yvonne Niedemeyer says, I'm new here to follow friends from the other group. For all of you new viewers, thank you for joining us tonight. Welcome to Color It Live. And definitely, if you are new, get ready to buckle yourself in for the exciting ride. <laughs> so what did we do? So we took off for Valentine's Day, but Valentine's night we went out with the kids, right? We uh... Everything's a blur. <laughs> Well, I know we had a special right. Valentine's night. You and I went out Saturday night. Right, but then right. on Valentine's Day, we did something special with the kids. We did something special with the kids, we that's made right. Steaks. Remember? Oh, that's right, that's right, yeah. Oh, yeah, so that's right. I went out with the kids during the day and got the steaks and brought them home. I but was doing something. I brought the kids to an Italian market. And they hated the smell of the provolone, so I was trying to get the steaks, and they were running out of the market. It was terrible. <laughs> All right. So, who's ready to get started? Hello, Color It Friends. Thank you guys so much for joining us tonight, and welcome to Color It Live, episode 71. If you're just joining us, please come down to the comments and say hello. Let us know where you're tuning in from. As always, if you have any questions or comments during the show, me and Mike will be answering them throughout the episode. Make sure you're sharing tonight's Color It Live because we're selecting, I know I said it once, but I'm going to tell you guys again, four lucky viewers who share throughout tonight's episode to win a set of 24 markers. That's right. Where is it? Over there. We're I got the 24 markers right. Here you go. You want to show them? So, Here you go. Here. Just as a reminder, you if you guys are for, if you're out of the United States, it's for U.S. residents only. So we're really sorry to our international audience, but this is what we'll be giving away. These beautiful markers, <laughs> this gorgeous, sturdy case. It even keeps all of these markers in their secure individual spots, double-sided markers. We're going to leave them right here so all right. everyone can see when we go to our Color It Central. So we're sorry for our international audience. But unfortunately, we can't do an international contest or giveaway just yet. But please stay tuned. We're trying to work that out for the future. Also, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel. YouTube, you're going to go to Color It Coloring Books so that you never miss a Color It video. Make sure you check out our newest tutorials because we have a lot of up and coming videos that you guys have requested. So if you have any other suggestions, please let us know. Also share our channel with all of your friends and family. And now, where are you going? I have a special announcement. You do, I'm gonna mess with these lights a little bit. I feel like the lights are a little bit strong. I love yeah. it. Do you? You're happy with it? Okay. I felt like it was so dark last week, so I said to AJ, turn up the lights. I want to have like that neon glow. Oh, uh, you got a year, you got neon glow, all right? Looking like um, <laughs> <laughs> All right, are you guys ready for our big announcement? I don't even know what the big announcement is. <laughs> so we're going to showcase all of your beautiful creations. But if you recall, we were really trying hard as a family, a color family, to hit. 70,000 70, followers. followers, that's right. And guess what? You guys did it. We're just a little shy on the likes, but we aren't going to focus on the likes tonight. We're going to focus <laughs> on what we achieved, and that's 70,000, a little bit over, 70,000 followers, guys. 70, Thank you all followers. so, so much. 
And let's hear it. We got to really like give it up to the colorettes in the house, the color studs. Come on, AJ. I'm right here. I'm right here. <laughs> the color studs. Oh, you want to see the couple? You can come back to color at Central. Oh, yeah, here we go. All right. Here He's we go. We're All right. So here we go for the color studs. <laughs> right there, color oh, studs. Me. How many? So out of 70,000, how many think are color studs? Like seven? <laughs> That's not what we're going to focus on tonight. We're going to focus on all of you guys all coming together, us as a big family, and hitting a huge mark. So let's hear it for all of you guys. Week after week, you send us beautiful creations, and we love seeing them. Thank you guys for supporting Color It every day. It means so much to us. And let's get right into all these gorgeous peacock submissions that we received a few weeks ago. I'm like dancing in the camera. It's so funny because it's delayed. So I turn and look at how silly I am. By the um, way, Erica, before we get started, happy birthday to Linda Duca. Turning 70 tomorrow. Wow, God bless you. Happy birthday. First up, we have Sherry Gravit. And this is so beautiful. I love this drawing, especially because you can really put so many different colors into it and you can see she went with the green and all the like orangey red pop of color in the flowers that looks great and I love how you did the top of the neck with the dark royal blue gorgeous job Sherry thank you for your submission Cheryl Canfield is up next and she has more of a pastel effect to the feathers and they're like this lightish blue, but they're also shaded into the darker section in the chest of the peacock with the rainbow colors, such gorgeous texture to the, to the feathers that you can see with the shading. And I really love how she outlined all of her roses in a deeper red and then also has that very light color in the petals. Beautiful Cheryl. Jean Bensey. Thank you for your submission. We have a bright hot pink and teal color peacock there with the light lavender at the top. I love how she interweaves the different color blue and the teal on the other peacock at the top and then all the different color flowers with the accent of the dark blue. Really looks nice. Thank you, Jean. Kelly Gordon with all different shades of green and then that bright fuchsia pink really brings out the green in the background and then she has little hints of orange she did a great job with her color choices there i love the way that she outlined each neck with the dark blue and then comes in with that royal lighter color blue beautiful kelly eric i missed it in the comments but i see that either mike or mia threw out there happy birthday charlene chase evans so of course happy birthday to charlene happy birthday marilyn petrovic love what you did here has she has all different color roses some are red some are orange and then all the greenery really stands out with the dark green and then you have in the feathers it's almost like a very aqua color blue with the green coming down the tail i love how that looks how she has that center going all the way down in green and then accenting in the yellow so Cindy Roth loves the green and another birthday out there to Margo Deacle. Margo, happy birthday. All right. Are you keeping watch on the clock so we know when we're going to get close uh, to yeah, it? Yeah, we are. What is it? It's about 9.09 right now. So we're about six minutes away. So 9.15, we're going to have the first set of 24 color markers Make of the sure evening. Make sure you guys are sharing. And if you share, calm down and let us know so AJ can give you a shout out. Sherry Howard is up next. I love this color of all the purple tones and the lavender in the background of the feathers and then little bits of pink throughout. That works really well there. And all of the green with the blue up towards the top peacock and then on the side how she has all the roses in, in that light peach and dark green color scheme. Great job with that. Just really stands out beautifully. Mm -hmm. So many of these you just want to put in a frame and share. <laughs> Heart submissions rolling right into those. And we have Cheryl Mickle up first. 
from our freebie Friday. And that is so beautiful. How did you guys all like our newest artist? This is from coming from our, I don't know. Where colorful. Is this is from our Colorful Seasons. Are we supposed to say that yet? Uh, well, the, the, it's already been put out there. I mean, we're, we're a little behind at this point. <laughs> Just to let you know. A little bit of a, a quick... And there were some questions earlier in the Color It Live tonight with, is that Colorful Seasons behind uh, behind us over here? And so yes, it is. This is from one of the seasons. We have a new artist here. And beautiful job. Let's get back to Cheryl, how she colored this so beautifully. As usual, she has such amazing creations. I love how she signs the bottom, but more importantly, how she incorporated the eight, the cupids at the top in like the gray and the tan. And it's just so cute with the purple and the pink standing out, but then has all the red tying everything in and the greenery. It just looks so beautiful. It reminds me of when I went to Venice and the guy was singing, Erika from America, <laughs> on, on the um, gondola ride. That's exactly how it looks, too. But I didn't have you by my side, baby. So it wasn't <laughs> Cupid. We'll have to go back and one love. day. love. <laughs> it was just for fun. Lori Patterson writes, Well, now I need the Colorful Seasons book. That's right. We're going to let you know when that will be available. Francis Weiss. We have up next and beautiful job with the pinks and the blue. And I just love how the roses all come together and it just looks so beautiful up in the sky with the cupids. Gorgeous. Jeannie Calhoun, another beautiful one here. Calhoun. That's right. <laughs> We have the gray sky with the clouds accents and all the bright red roses. Everyone does such gorgeous work. I love everyone's take how it's different, but it's the same design and everyone has different colors that they choose and all look so beautiful. Purple on the cushions and then in the background you have that purple tying it together. Gorgeous. Thank you for your submission. Mary Thompson, loving all the yellow and the brown tones. That, that looks awesome, how you have all the outlining of the brown and then the light pastel colors and peach. I really love how this came all together. The cupid outlining the wings. Hey, Eric, I just noticed our good friend Carly Ringer is here with us tonight. Carly, welcome hey, to Carly. Color It Live. And also, we had a question just a second ago. I'm trying to find it here from Susan Yanni. Do you have a spring book? I guess the answer is kind of. Kind of. Stay, stay tuned, stay Susan. Tuned. We, have, we have something coming for you a little later Very in the program. Very exciting. So we have Pam Boy up next. And another gorgeous job here with the pastels and then the darker tones that she brought forward with the branches. And I just love how you incorporated the darker colors with the light, gorgeous contrast. Beautiful, thank you. Rhonda Petronico. I love how it has like all of the blues, that, that blue bright color, and then the yellow combination with the green. And then also how she tied in the black part, was, which really brings forward that pink heart and how the Cupid has that same pink. And is taking that arrow right to that. <laughs> Someone's going to feel love in the air tonight. Who feels it? So, Erica from Peggy Gambrel. Purple is my favorite color. And there's our good friend Carly again sending everyone greetings from the Jersey Shore. Yes, you're back safe and sound. So happy that you're back home. All right, so we're going to roll right into the Color It Weekly theme challenge. All right, and I'll here we go. Oh, you want to come back to Color It Central? Yes. All right. Listen. And we're going to give something away. We got to get, yeah, we're about one minute away from giving something away. Okay, okay so back here to Color guys. It Central. Woo. There it is, the 24. Four of these are going to be going out tonight. Four of these tonight yes. going out. Woo. Sorry, I took it from you there. I was just trying to get it close. Go ahead. You, you take fine. it over. Go ahead. That's fine. Go ahead. They take it. Go. Go ahead. All right, so. The Color It Weekly Challenge, of course, is run so awesomely by Nicole, Cheryl, and Angela at the Color It Coloring Books group page. If you are not already a member, 
What are you waiting for? Get over to the Color It Coloring Books group page. Such an awesome page. Some of the best designs out there. Everyone is so supportive. Gives great suggestions. Uh, has a great time with everyone's design. So get over there tonight. Cheryl, if you can, seems like you're with us tonight. I guess you got a free night on Facebook. So nice. get over into the comments. Post the link down below. And guys, get on over there. Have some fun. Post some designs. And it is 9.15. Are we it's ready for a winner? Time. All right, here we go. All right, All right. so. Someone is going to get this gorgeous set of 24 markers. Double-sided bullet and chisel side. Nice, strong caps. They're all uh, numbered and named. You got the winner? I got the winner. All right. I'm letting you do your Congratulations. thing. Congratulations. Jennifer Shook Alberini. Jennifer Shook Alberini. Taking home the 20. Go ahead. You show them off. Go ahead. Taking home. We keep going for the markers. Taking home the 24 markers. Jennifer, come on down to the comments. Let us know what you will be coloring with the markers. Be sure to send your designs in and get an email out to support at colorit.com. Let them know you won the markers. We'll get them right out to you. Congratulations. All right, so AJ told you guys about our weekly theme challenge, and we're going to go first up, Ali Franco. So we have this is coming from our Colors of Inspiration book, and resilience, such a strong word. I love this. Oh, Erica, sorry about that. Virginia's here with us tonight. Of course, oh, my sister, timing. Virginia Bufumo Falkenberg, the artist of so many of the books you see right here behind us tonight. Hey, oh, and there she is right there. There's Virginia's design yeah, right that's there. Right wow. Where said it. I was looking down. Yeah, there she you go. She drew this beautiful and, and Allie colored it together. Look at this amazing creation. I love how she it's has a collaboration. the collaboration. Yes. Reds and pink and the ribbon looks so strong. The resilience there. I love how she had like the black going through and the white <laughs> pattern with the pink. And it's almost like a reddish um, orange. Awesome job, Allie. Thank you. Jeannie, write, Jeannie Newton Calhoun writes, I went from Fig Newton to Calhoun. <laughs> and we have Amy Fultz, another design drawn by Virginia Falkenberg from Colorful Flowers. And this is amazing. Like, she brought in her own dot, like white dots throughout. Way to free your creativity, Amy. I love how you have that pattern of color. It almost looks like she chose two or three of the markers and, and really tied them all in together. Beautiful job. So yeah. from, I'm sorry, Erica, from Diane Harrison. Uh, Diane Harrison is a cancer survivor here with us tonight. So happy you're here with us tonight. Go get them, Diane. Welcome to Color It Live. And we got another Virginia here. We got Virginia Gates here with us tonight. Would love some markers. We're rooting for you. We'll be giving away three more tonight. The next one in about 12 minutes. And we have Angela Lorenzo. Check out this from our Manzala's Volume 1. These colors are spectacular. I love how it's just all weaved in together with the pink and then the hot pink and the light pink. Beautiful job, Angela. And that black is like coming out towards, keeps your eye focused right in the center part of the mandala. Belinda Waters from Mandala's Volume 1. Gorgeous job. Check out the pattern. It's almost like you're looking through a kaleidoscope here. How it just has such a great effect with the black standing out and the white and the red and the peach colors all together. Gorgeous job, Belinda. And a quick shout out, Erica, to Mary Richmond, who is also a cancer survivor, here with us tonight on Color It Live. So happy you're here with us. And I love this from Kathy Kuzan from our Colors of Inspiration book. I love how the hearts are just three-dimensional here. And they almost have a, a wet feel because the way that she shaded them and then also accented at the top with the white. And then the glitter part of where she put the love with the glitter throughout the black really stands out for me there. Gorgeous, Kathy. Erica, real quick here. So our first winner of the evening, we got a thank you here from Jennifer Shook Alberini. Congratulations. Can't wait to see your designs with your new markers. This is really cool from Kristen Disselhorse. Oh, yeah. From our Colorful Quilts book. And I just love how it all like flows together with the pinks. Um, also, 
as you can see, all the colors are the same throughout the designs, but they all look different and each design is different. And it just shows you that you could take three or four same colors and just each design will look different for you. So this is awesome how the pattern part was the pink and then outlining. I really like how you outlined the pink with the red. That works beautifully. We have Cindy Batdorf from our traveling mandalas. And it looks like she used our gel pens here because you can, if you look up closely, you can really see the glitter off of the page, shining off the page with the bright pink. I just love all that pink that she carried throughout. Gorgeous job with the accenting of the green glitter. Love that, Cindy. Kim McLaughlin from our dogs, everyone's best friend. Love this design. Love how you have all the different colors of the pink shading around the eyes and all around the nose and the, the part of the neck that you left white really looks great. And the white out in the background, how it's alternating, that is awesome. And Erica, real quick, I've been reading here in the comments, we want to send our warmest wishes out uh, to Mary Richmond who recently lost her father. Uh, the warmest wishes coming out to you, Mary, from all of us here at Color It. Savannah York from Colors of Inspiration. I really love, love, <laughs> how the love has it in red and then how she outlined it, the heart. And <laughs> you got that later. Um, I'm reading it in the comments. Uh, <laughs> wait, 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 go ahead. <laughs> what was it again? Because <laughs> I was like, I really love, love, get it? <laughs> I guess you missed that. So the heart, how that the red uh, has the red in the center and then the pink on the outside and then all the white really on the outlining sections looks amazing. Thank you, Savannah. So Erica, I have from Kimberly Bennett here. I love you all. This is an awesome site. We love you right back, Kimberly. And here's James Burdig with possibly the quote of the night, comment of the night. Do you ever give a book instead of markers or pencils? Not saying that I don't want markers. <laughs> and uh, our yeah, good friend. So answer it. <laughs> well, well, yeah, I'll get to that one second. I'm sorry. Our good friend Steve Kristen is here with us tonight. Steve, what is going on? Welcome to Color Alive. You know, it was at one point, I think, that we used to just have one winner yeah, and allow that winner to choose, choose their, their prize. Yeah, we were also doing books. We, do, we mix it up. We so we mix it up, yeah. Wait, I want to read this one. Go ahead. Uh, Randy says, I was never really into coloring until I received my first color book a year ago for Christmas and been hooked ever since. We're so happy you're part of the Color It family, Randy. Thanks for that. Thanks so much, Randy. And Erica, um, uh, the warmest wishes from the whole Color It family to Belinda, who unfortunately lost her brother in the month of February. Belinda, the warmest wishes from all of us here at Color It. And we have um, from Traveling Doodles, Smriti Marwa. And this looks awesome. I really love how you have the pink and the what and the pink and the red pattern towards the bottom and then all the different red and black towards that and then highlighting up at the top with the hot pink combination of the hot pink behind the red great placement of color there loving that i didn't see anything in the comments erica but i do see mike or mia here sending out thoughts and prayers to sydney and her family amy folks so i i'm, I'm not quite certain um if this is for Sydney or Amy, but of course, uh, we're sending our warmest thoughts from the entire Color family and a very happy birthday to Penny LaValle. Just celebrate her 59th birthday. Happy, happy birthday. Happy birthday. So, what time we got here? We're we at 9, uh, 9 24. Okay, we have some time. So, Color Weekly theme challenge, you voted Blissful Scenes. So, we're going to go over all the beautiful creations, starting with Bar Coil from our Blissful Scenes book. And I know a lot of you are enjoying that coloring book. So let's start with Barb. Loving how you have all the alternating colors and the flowers at the bottom. That really stands out for me there. I love how you have the bucket, how it's shaded, and all of the browns, the texture that they have. You feel like you're just right there about to send down that bucket for water. Oh, wow, Erica. We have our good friend Denise Hoops on here tonight with Color It Live. Hello. 
Bonita Merrill, and this one just really has such bright colors. It gets you so excited for spring. Who is ready to kick the winter season to the curb? I know I am, but we had such a tease today in New Jersey with weather. It was like 75. <laughs> Crazy. So, Erica, I just got the comment here from Mia. I want to go ahead and read this. Uh, this is from Amy Folks on the topic of cancer. Can I ask AJ and Erica to pray for my friend Sydney? She is eight years old and ending her battle with childhood cancer. Please pray for peace and comfort for the family. Her picture is in my profile picture. Uh, so, of course, Amy, we're sending our warmest thoughts and prayers, not only from us, but from the entire Color of Family. Let's take a moment for that. God bless them. So we have Bonita Merrill. And I just really love all the bright colors that she has here with all of the combinations of inside the flower. And I mean, all this is very challenging. When you're looking at a, a blank canvas of just black and white and you have to think about what colors to use, you know, it's not easy as all of you know. And, and this is like awesome how it's the light blue and the darker blue on the outside of the flower and then that light brown with the orange tones that all goes really nicely thank you bonita so erica angel henley hi sorry i'm late <laughs> better late than never happy to have you here angel so glad you made it chris giobalt from our blissful scenes here we got an amazing creation with all the yeah, greenery really nice. and wow. how you outlined the palm trees really stands out. Even though it's in the background, it's still able to come forward with the technique that you use there. And I love your stones, how the background of the stones have like that gravel feel to them. Great job, Chris, thank you. Erica, Virginia Gates asks, are most of the coloring shown tonight done with markers or pencils? What do you think? There's a whole combination. Some are gel pens, yeah. markers. And then Pencils, there's Cindy Roth. And then we have Cindy Roth. This looks like she used some markers, maybe a combination of things. I'm sure she's on and she can let us know in the comments what you used on this beauty. Look at the way that just pops. It's just, I mean, she has so many creations. She's like shared so many of them and she just completed a full book that she shared with everyone. And I just love seeing your creation, Cindy, and thanks for being such a strong contributor in the community. It's awesome. Beautiful job. I love how you do like really the depth of the colors, like in the bottom of the <laughs> of the petals and then at the top how the light is hitting. She really has such a great technique where the light you can feel that you're there looking at it and the top of the leaves have the yellow look and then how she outlined the watering can, beautiful, Cindy, thank you. Dave Lewis, we have here. Ah, color stud, we got a color stud. That's right, and look at him go. With yeah, that's not just any color stud, look at this guy. I love that. We should have a, a color stud competition and really bring all the color studs out of <laughs> the work. I'll have to finish my cat. <laughs> oh, gosh. So, Dave, I really love how you have all the different rainbow colors in the flowers that was a great choice and then the reddish brown part of the um the well what is that called yeah, <laughs> the wishing top, well. yeah, the what, well, what's yeah. the top called the roof i don't know if you the, would call it the yeah, roof. i guess the roof yeah <laughs> i'm lost for words here the wishing well roof <laughs> i love how that looks how it has that texture of the brick our reddish brown works really nicely uh, there in the sky and the greenery. Erica, Brenda Green writes, hello everyone, I'm here. <laughs> Welcome there. Brenda, glad you're here. Gail Larson, this is one of my favorite designs from Blissful Scenes. I just love how Hasby drew this one and, and like... Yeah, it's cool. It's just, you can see inside the pumpkin house and then the logs and just how you color this with the sun again like that <laughs> highlight i gotta think i gotta remember this that's a, a really awesome technique because you're really bringing light into your picture i love that one minute away guys one so minute think, away all right let's see i have well, I'm, I'm not gonna go through i don't want to rush through so let's go back to color it central do you we're have, going to color do it central the mania or can i do this one i'll do this Joyce Young. 
I want to say you did a magnificent job with the way that you patterned out the top of the um, of the awning and I love how it has the purple and the pink and the aqua and then all the gorgeous flowers with all of the baskets, how you have them shaded so beautifully and the outlining of the petals. You really did a magnificent job, Joyce, with this one. Thank you so much for your submission. All right, so here we go, back to Color It Central. And we're back. All right, and the 24 markers. So, the first set of the evening went to Jennifer Shook Alberini. The second set of the evening going to Sherry Gravit. Sherry yeah. Gravit, congratulations. Yeah. Taking home the set of 24 color markers. Those are yours right there. Please shoot an email out to support at colorit.com. Again, that's support at colorit.com. Tell them you won the markers right here on Color It Live. That's right. Thank you. I'm going to switch back over. And we have Kathy Davenport from... Um, again, we're going over, if you're just joining, our Blissful Scenes here, and this is so cool how she has her name at the bottom, and then she has the outline of the heart in purple background, and then all of the colors just pop with that bright red rose at the top. I love how that turned down, and all the green. There's bright green, lime green, dark green. That, that looks awesome. Gorgeous colors there. Thank you, Kathy. Christina Russell, we have the peacock feathers that are just in rows. You see how she did that technique with the purple and the green and the lime green. And then she, she basically took that all the way down to the bottom of the tail. And it has all that darker purple and the lighter pink blended in and all the blues at the top. Lovely job with the roses, how they're two tones the darker pink and then the lighter inside of the petal and the greenery around it. I love that, Christina. Thank you. Last but not least, we have Nicole Williams. Loving your creation here. That looks so awesome. The steel, it really came out bright with the glitter in the center of the um, and the apples at the top with the lime greenish colored apples. I love how your tree is. This is such a cute design how the squirrels are helping. <laughs> I just love this. And the buckets of apples. I love how you did the brown tones throughout and all the greenery. Gorgeous job. Thank you, Nicole. Hope you're doing well. Thanks for being on Color It Live. All right, guys, so that was our last one there. So I'm back. Welcome back. <laughs> so remember, if you have submissions that you want to share with us, you're going to use hashtag MyColorIt on Instagram, Pinterest, Twitter, and Facebook. You can also post your submission to the Color It Comp Facebook visitor post or our community page on our Color It website. You can also email us at support at colorit.com. So tell us what you think. What did you guys think about this week's submissions? I see all of the comments rolling in, and I know you guys have been hitting the like button, hearts. Tell us if there's something special that really was able to inspire your creativity and come down to the comments throughout the show and let us know if you've been sharing, because guess what? We still have these beauties to give away and we want you guys to be the winners. So definitely keep sharing. If you share, come down to the comments and let us know that you shared so we can personally thank you. And who wants to see what we're coloring? But first, I have something special to show you. I don't know, for most of you, you must remember that I was telling you Ashley has been working long, long <laughs> hours on her creation. And before we get to our coloring tonight, I want to share with you what she did. All right, so let me go over here. And this is her. I mean, she spent hours. It's just fabulous. I'm so proud of her. 
how she just continues to improve. I know you guys are going to flip out when you see this. I'll give it a second to come up. But her boot came out so amazing. Just the colors, and she analyzed what colors that she wanted to use and all the flowers. And this was like the first time that she didn't do all the one petal, one solid color, but she brought in all different colors. And then you can see how she did that with all the flowers. And I'm not sure if, um, I'm not sure if you saw her other ones that she's been coloring, but I know you guys were asking for Ashley's creation, so I'll just show you them again in case you didn't see them. That really is spectacular. I mean, look at what she did here. That's our girl. She's awesome. She's amazing. So that's the boot. And Charlene, then, Charlene writes, great job, Ashley, Cindy. Oh, she did an awesome job. Nicole, beautiful. I'm pretty sure we did this one. She was telling me, no, I don't think you showed them that one, but I think I did. And then this one, she wanted me to tell you guys this, that the lips, well, when I get to it, she put really red all over <laughs> the girl's lips. I was like, oh, dude, is that lipstick? And she's like, no. She took a bite of the cake. <laughs> <laughs> she wanted to show that she snuck a bite before she served it. And, and Virginia writes, Ashley, that's lovely, just like you. Aww. With hearts in every color of the rainbow. And that's her other one. And this one, I'm not sure if you guys saw. Amy... She's I'm sorry, Amy, folks, so amazing. Great job, Ashley. Lynn, wow, she did such an awesome job. All right, well, there's all of Ashley's creations. <laughs> Steve, Steve writes, the workout pick is awesome. Steve, I want you to color that. Steve, I'm going to send that one to you. I want you to color that one. We'll get that up on Color It Live. Nicole, Nicole writes, Ashley rocks. Susan Steiner, beautiful. Love the soft colors. Chrissy. I'm going to turn it this Great way. Great job, Ashley. Let me know if you guys can see. Should I turn it this way? Because you have it uh, this way. So this is what we're coloring tonight, guys. Okay. Is that okay? Let uh, me have some let's hearts. See. Let's see how it... If you guys can see it like that. And... That's fine. Yeah. If you want to get your winter cat, go to color.com, winter cat. I'm going to get some music. Come down. To the comments, tell AJ what colors you want me to get started with. I'll be watching. Amy, Let's... she is one talented. Sorry about that, Erica. Go ahead. <laughs> I don't let you get a word in edgewise. No, nah, you're, you're, <laughs> just, you're just, you got the momentum juggernaut. going, the juggernaut. Well, I want to make sure we get to everything <laughs> and we're going to color our winter cat. Virginia. I'm excited about the winter cat. Virginia just asked, where's Eric's? <sighs> He's not really into this just yet. He's working up to his creations. So let us know how you guys are doing tonight. Tell us what you did for Valentine's Day. How did you spend Valentine's Day? Let me know what colors you want to see. Drop a comment in the in the comment section and tell us what colors you want me to start. Do you have any colors yet? Nancy Klein with red. That's the first one I saw tonight. Red. All right, I'm going to start with red. Where do you want me to put the red, the Cheryl, is Cheryl guessing or does Cheryl already know what the link is for this tonight? I just said it. Oh, you did? All right. I missed you saying it. All right. Cheryl, no, because Cheryl, Cheryl used to guess them. I know. She was right. She always got it right. So it's colorit.com forward slash winter cat. It's so funny. How does she do that? So I'm going to start with this color. Go ahead. All right, so Erica's going to start with... Do we have some music going in the background there? Yep. Hearts, if you hear All the right. music, is it too loud? Is it just right? Let us know. So Jolie Johnson wants to see some yellows, blues, and greens. Nancy Klein with purple. Carissa Priori writes, I love to color. It's a great coping skill for me. Nicole wants to see purple, blue, and silver. Shanice is going to get some rest. Unfortunately, having some trouble with her back. All the best, Shanice. Renee Kirsch, purple. There's a surprise. Lori Palmer, red, green, blue, brown. Linda Cartwright, purple. Uh, so from Anna Newcomb Savori. Shiri Gravit will be so happy she won the markers. Thank you, AJ and Erica. She had to go to bed early. But Deanna is going to see her in the morning with the coffee and the good news. Sounds awesome. 
And where are we? We're at 939, so we're about six minutes away from giving away our third set on the evening. What else do we have going on here? Virginia Gates, I'm a newbie with all this and learning to color has helped me with patience and all. That is awesome. Cindy Roth wants to see green and light green on the leaves. Our best wishes to Dana. Unfortunately, Dana's uncle passed away during the week, uh, about a week ago, and um, sending our warmest wishes from the color family. Pam Alberts went shopping on Valentine's Day. Margaret saw her boyfriend on Sunday for a belated Valentine's Day. Barb spent Valentine's Day in the hospital having a knee replacement. Well, there's all sorts of Valentine's Day and um, hopefully that all went well, Barb. Glad you're back here with us tonight on Color It Live. Jimmy Dickerson, Color Stud wants to see some green. Elizabeth wants to see orange. <laughs> So this beautiful design that I'm coloring tonight is from our upcoming book. And as with all of our books, we have our top spiral binding. We have our high quality, artist quality, color it white paper. All of our pages are perforated so you can share oh. them. What? And this book is amazing because this is the first time that we had four artists all wrapped up into this one book for all of you guys. So you get the luxury of having four different techniques in one book. What do you guys think about that? How about that? Four artists coming together for one epic what color it coloring book. So Erica from Jennifer Latour Baker here. AJ, would you mind sending a shout out to Cheryl Mickle? I was out of town over the weekend and my car got broken into in the parking garage. They stole my backpack full of colored supplies, several coloring books, both gel pen sets, and the 72 coloring pencil set. I was so upset that I was crying. Cheryl told me to PM her my address so that she could send me some supplies. I was so touched by that. They did end up finding my backpack in one of the stairwells of the parking garage and all my colored stuff was there and accounted for. So I didn't need to take Cheryl up on the offer, but it meant so much to me at the time. Jennifer, thanks so much for sharing. So sorry about the car, but glad that you did retrieve your color and stuff. And Cheryl, thanks so much for giving back to the color of family. Charlene and her boyfriend went out to dinner for Valentine's Day. Carissa, that will be awesome. I'm a little behind on the comments here, but I'm sure it is awesome. Uh, Vilma, my boyfriend surprised me by cooking dinner. Dakota Kamusha, when is the, net, the new book available? Do you know, actually, I, I'm sorry, I actually don't know. <laughs> I probably shouldn't have read that comment, but now that's out there. Uh, Mike or me, if you know when the book is going to be available, go ahead and throw that down in the comments. From Benita Merrill, oh, I like hearing when someone helps others. That is awesome. From Charlene, you're a gem, Cheryl Mickle. How are you making out over there, babe? All right? Yeah. All right. I, I just don't know what colors. That's like what I always <laughs> Chrissy writes, I need a man to cook for me. <laughs> Cheryl writes, writing back, to, uh, Cheryl writing back, thank you, Charlene, that's so sweet of you. All right, guys, I am back with you. Just had to shoot a quick message out to Mike there. Um... What else do we have going on here? Gladys Steed wants to know, what is the name of the new coloring book? You know what, babe? You know what? We're going to flip through it as soon as you're done. What book? That book, right there. I think you're on, right? What are you doing? Is this the book right here? Is this the book? The book? Heidi? Right here? What do you think? This is a private session? <laughs> is it right here with us right now? Uh-oh. 
very special is about to happen. Something very special about to happen. Are you guys excited? Erica, a lot of the... I'm going to just pause and start showing A lot of the colorettes. Here's Carissa in there again. It's coming along beautifully. I need a man to cook for me. How about me with my cooking, babe, huh? You're good. Right? With meat. If Particularly want, with the meat. If you want to have a lot of things to clean in your kitchen, <laughs> after AJ's done, he probably uses about 25 pots and pans, but it tastes delicious. So it That's taste right. It doesn't matter. That's right. And if so let's, Virginia's around, the kitchen is clean and tasty. Oh, Virginia, forget it. She's no a record girl. Like All right, so let me put this out there to, to, to the colorettes out there. So let me let me throw this at Perry Thompson. Did he cook dinner and wash the dishes? Yes. Uh, so, I don't, I don't yeah, talk about me. You did. Yeah, I do it. You did fine. for Valentine's Day. I don't know you did. That's right, because we took off Color Alive. Yes. Thank so, you, guys. So, let me ask you guys something here. All right, so, for the Colorettes out there, would you rather have a great tasting meal and some work to do in the kitchen, or an okay meal and a clean kitchen? What are you guys? What are you guys going with? A fantastic tasting meal? Or both? Why can't we get a clean kitchen and a? Well, I, I can't throw throw C <laughs> both out there. That's going to be the answer. Oh come on! All right. Am I going to show everyone what they really want to say? Yeah, go ahead. All Here right. we go, guys. So Here we, we go. We have been working long and hard on this amazing book. Check out that cover. Colorful seasons, guys. That's right. 50 original hand-drawn designs. Four amazing artists. Four amazing seasons. We start out here. I'm going to lower this a little bit because I'm hearing that we're getting some echoing. Oh, and we're going to turn down the, uh, let's turn down the audio. The, um, oh, let's just talking turn this down a little bit. No, that's okay. Our you belongs to page, our tips page, our blotter. All of our pages are perforated. We have our Happy New Year's to start the year off right. Some winter designs. So this is our newest artist. And he did an amazing job. A different type of technique, as you can see. So hopefully you guys love him like you love all the others. Mardi Gras. <laughs> we're getting some, Erica, we're getting some answers on this. So Fiona, Fiona wants the good food. Fiona wants the good food, but I guess Teresa's saying an okay meal in a clean kitchen. Mm. Nancy Klein, okay meal in a clean kitchen. I'm going through a book right now. This is like, you know, important right now. We have a winter scene here. Here for all of our St. Patrick's Day lover creation. <laughs> AJ loves this one with the bears in the cave. The raccoon. Oh, I was about to say someone already colored in this book. <laughs> hey, that was me. Dana, <laughs> Dana writes, I need that book. Love it already. A little scene we got here for winter. This one's pretty awesome. I love those, um, what do you call them? Snow, snow globes? Yeah. When you shake it up and all the snow. How awesome is that one? Sandy, Christmas. I am so looking for... Oh, there's the blotter. Sandy, I am so looking forward to this book. And now we have spring. And this is Stefan. Hey, Lori, Lori, said, Lori said she'll take a great meal in a dirty kitchen. Mm. You love this topic. <laughs> it's a good one. Stefan did an amazing job on spring. You can see all the flowers, the rain boots. Butterflies, lots of birds and lots of butterflies, dragonflies, everything you can think of spring, roses, birds, a flower manzala. <laughs> Elizabeth Haskell writes, I'll take whatever I can get. <laughs> Winter with Ivan, spring with Stefan, mm -hmm. summer with Hasby, <laughs> the surfboard, some ice cream, palm trees, get a little bit of everything. Fourth of July, 
really takes you through the whole year, huh? <laughs> and we got this from all of you guys. You guys requested all different seasons, so we thought we would do a collaboration and surprise you all. So what do you think? Pretty spring pictures, and you have all different types of um, artists. So you have different styles, mm -hmm. all all in one. So nice combination of different designs. The lighthouse. From Sherry McNew, I just love the concept of this book, all seasons together in one to work on all year round. Now we're heading into our fall season. So get ready for harvest, trick-or-treating, pumpkins. And of course the artist on the fall this season. Turban Basuki. We have this fall wreath with the owl. I mean, Turbot's always been such a spectacular artist, but he's really, really grown over the years. Yeah, and this is probably the thinnest lines that he's ever done. So let us know if you like that. And we're getting a big hand clap from Pam. And me or Mike, if you can uh, shoot down in the comments, uh, let us know when this is going to be available for sale. I, I, I don't know, I'm sorry. Me or Mike, if you can, just jump down in the comments, let us know when this will be available and I'll read that out. Everybody wants to pre-order. That's awesome. I love the time. Diana Sanderson. I love it, and I can't wait to get it. Vilma Ruth with happy faces all over the place. We're so happy you guys love it. From Teresa Turner, I'm going to order two of these, one for me and one for my best friend to introduce her to Color It. And there you have it. Colorful seasons, the change of seasons. Is nature's own way of coloring. How beautiful is that? All right, guys. We better give away a set of we gotta get markers. back to color central here. I wish I could hear everyone hooting and hollering and all the excitement. All right, we're giving another set away. Who's excited? Ready all right, to go? Here we go. And we're at color at central. That's right. All right, and so our first one of the night was Jennifer Shook Alberini. Second one of the night was Sherry Gravit. And our third winner of the evening of 24 Color It Markers is Vivian Ringel. Vivian Ringel, congratulations to Vivian Ringel taking home the 24 markers. Please shoot an email out to support at colorit.com. Tell them you won the markers and to get you your markers so you can get some designs to us and to your Color It family and to the Color It Coloring Book group page. Cheryl, go ahead, put that down in the comments. Congratulations. A few announcements. Oh, Uncle Alan's here. Hey, Uncle Alan, I love you. So glad you're here. All right. Um, so I have to go over here. So again, if you guys want to get your drawing for free tonight, check it out. Go right here. And you have to go to color.com forward slash winter cat. And at the bottom, click on this blue download now button. And you will get your very own free download, guys. So hurry up and get that if you haven't already done so and make sure you take advantage of our 10 free spiritual drawing downloads because you want to make sure you don't forget to sign up for those whether you're just trying to add some spirituality to, what is wrong with me spirituality <laughs> to your art or try to get closer with your faith here's 10 free spiritual Coloring pages perfect for any colorist out there. Go to color.com forward slash prayer and sign up. You'll be able to get one free scripture coloring page every other day direct to your inbox. See these beautiful, all of these right here. And you're also going to want to check out our YouTube channel, which we're trying really hard to get up to a thousand. We're at 887 subscribers. 887. We want to get to a thousand. So please help us to get to a thousand 
So you're going to go to Color It, Coloring Books, and check out all the new videos. We have coloring fur textures and shading with our Color It colored pencils. What is that? You're I think I'm pulling, out the, I'm pulling out the color studs. Yeah. And all of our previous episodes of Color It Live are there. You can find um, different techniques. So tell us what tutorials that you really want to see and let us know. And uh, we'll try to put them on our channel for you guys. Also, our February Fan of the Month. Let's see what we have there since February is almost over. And we have all of these free pages that people have had the opportunity of coloring. Check that out. That one's not ours, so I don't know why that's there. But at the top, you have all the different books. And it must be a color at coloring page. Lipstick on a pig. <laughs> Do you remember that one? That was my best friend Erica's input for what um, idiom yeah. to use. I was like, come on, give me an idiom and we'll put it in the book. That was the one she wanted me to use. So we have all of these. You guys are amazing. Just like last month, we'll be picking six winners to win a $25 color gift card. And at the end of the month, we'll pick three winners based on a set criteria. And then we have three random um, winners who will be given a chance so that we make sure everyone has a fair shot at winning. Lori and Patterson writes, oh, that warrior was mine. Oh, how cool is that? So you're going to want to go to color.com forward slash fan. And please make sure that um, for these submissions that you only go through the website, colorit.com forward slash fan, so that we make sure that you're sending your submissions through the website only. Ashley, uh, <laughs> Erica. <laughs> hey, Erica, real quick. No, because I, I, I thought I saw Ashley on here. Uh, there's that, uh, who was it that um, has been submitting the three-dimensional designs. One of them is on there. Um, you just scroll by it. But real quick, a question here from Virginia Gates. Do y'all have instructions on blending colors with pencils? I'm learning how, but would like some help. Yes, there is a tutorial on the YouTube channel. Color it coloring books on YouTube. Scroll back up because there's the uh, that three-dimensional. I know we've been getting a few of those. I, I, it slips my mind. Right there, the bicycle. Oh, okay. Oh, See that is that that's Audrey? Okay, yeah. Click on that one. Show that. One. Look at that. How crazy is that from Audrey? How do you do that? She just she yeah. She colored and then she cut it out and she made it three dimensional. That's really spectacular. She did another one is too. That, I don't. Is that she made it into a card? I don't know. if She made it into a card or what? She she did another one too that she posted was really good. And just so you guys know, if you've already won a prize. Oh, there you go. There's Audrey with me. Audrey, what was the other one that you did? Uh, Are you so. Chatting? Well, not really chatting. I'm just reading the comments. Oh, no, because at the Where? top, I think that's a new oh, feature. Yeah, that green feature that was yeah. popping up. So, yeah, so that was Audrey, and she did do the uh, the three-dimensional bicycle. And then, Audrey, what was the other one that you did? Cheryl writes, wee, Audrey. 958, we're going to have another set of 24 markers in Look at all of these. And about two minutes here. So wait, I was telling them if they already won a prize in any of our monthly giveaways, we have to mention that if you won on Color It Live or you're a runner up in any of the Fan of the Month contests, you won't be able to win another contest for one year just so that we give everyone a fair shot at winning. That's so right. Check these out. Audrey, Audrey, uh, Audrey wrote it was the Griffin. I, I knew it was the Griffin. I was thinking Griffin or Dragon there? from Mythical and Fantasy. I didn't see that. Now, but I know it's on the. Uh, it's probably on our page. It's also on the uh, Color Coloring Book Group page. Thank you. God bless you, Audrey. I don't know if you could put a link to that down in the comments, but that is awesome. I remember when we had like five <laughs> pictures here. Now you, it just keeps going on and on and on. Gail Larson's here. What's going on, Gail? All right, let's go back to Color at Central. We're going back to Color at Central. It's 9.59. And we're going to get ready to announce our final winner. All I swear, right. every time I come down to the basement, I get all congested. Yeah. It must be freezing down here or something. Freezing down here, you think, yeah. <laughs> My nose is ice cold. <laughs> and it was really hot today. I swear, it was like 75 degrees. Yeah, it was a... Uh... Oh, it was a February in Jersey. Yeah. But tomorrow it'll be 30s, and then everybody will start coughing and sneezing. 
you know how that goes. All right. So it's 9.59. You think anyone will care if I announce the winner now? I don't know. All right. So. All right, yeah, so no. here we go. The 24 markers. Uh, the fourth set of the evening. So the first set went to Jennifer Shook Alberini. Second set to Shiri Gravit. Third winner of the evening was Vivian Ringel. And the fourth set of 24 markers on the evening going to Paula Sue Dinsmore. Nice. Paula Sue Dinsmore taking home the 24 markers. Congratulations, Paula. Thanks so much, everyone, for being here tonight on Color It Live. Erica, take it away. We hope you'll join us for another episode of Color It Live next week. It's going to be February 28th at 9 p.m. Eastern, 6 p.m. Pacific. Don't forget to mark your calendars. Enjoy the rest of your evening and free your creativity.